sorrow tore into the hearts of those with native blood when the devil's own invaded homes and stole the ones they loved. Shattered lives, their babies gone, ripped from trembling hands, too numb to speak, too shocked to weep, too confused to understand. Deeply stricken in their grief, their lives were torn apart. No words could ever heal the pain within their broken hearts. Not knowing if they'd ever see their children there again, a vacant spot inside the home was all that was left of them. Too young to be away from home, without a parent's care, without a gentle guiding hand, and the love both parents share. Clutched in the grasp of demon hands were children frail and young, beaten if they cried for home, or spoke their native tongue. A ruthless act by evil hearts, yet in church those sinners prayed. But the brand of shame stamped on their faith will forever be displayed. We'll never know the awful truth, so much has been concealed. And the trauma every child endured will never be revealed. What went through the fragile minds of those with strength to mourn, seeing little ones in blankets wrapped in cold and lifeless form? Hidden there beneath the sod, outside those schoolhouse walls, in eternal sleep, no more to weep, they lay on claim. Words could never right the wrongs committed there each day, nor can those who were involved e'er make amends or pay. But if justice lies beyond this world and judgment rolls are called, atonement for their evil deeds rests solely with their God.